Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we are going to see how to upgrade your book converter LM 2596 or any kind of book converter with this method. So, here also, this will provide the short circuit protection at the output. And uh, I will use the components from the LM2596 buck converter module. And uh, here this is the main components. This is the SMD version of the LM358 IC. So this will use the uh, with the combination of the low value resistor. When the current is passes through the low value resistor, the voltage will drop, and we will measure the dropped voltage and compare with the reference voltage given with the potentiometer so that we can control the output current in any kind of a converter and here the this is the IC which is uh, as you can see written on this here uh, the LM2596S this is the 5 pin based uh, buck converter IC and uh, now we are going to place all the components on the PCB which I will provide all the details of the PCB in the description and uh, if you interested in making the PCB at home so that you can check out my previous video of which I have shown how to make the PCB at home so I am going to place all the components on this PCB and uh, after completing all the thing the PCB will look like this so here you can see I have changed one components which I used to AMS 3117 regulator instead of uh, the LM7805 regulator and uh, the input voltage from my power supply is 11.5 volts for the testing with the model now here you can see the negative terminal and uh, the positive terminal marked on the PCB now the blue LED is glowing which will indicate the input power and uh, the green LED will show the output voltage now we will connect the crocodile clip at uh, the output terminal so that we can use with multimeter and uh, other load testing purpose and uh, here uh, I accidentally sorted the current limiting register which is very tiny SMD register because the LED damaged so no problem with this and uh, you can see the short circuit protection of this circuit is working very perfect as the red LED on the circuit is showing the short circuit protection as actively working and uh, the circuit is not blowing which is very perfect for this project now here the output voltage is 9 volt we will adjust this voltage for testing this module as you can see the voltage dropping very low up to 1.4 volts so this is the basically buck converter so that we can control the output voltage below the given voltage as for example if we given the 12 volts in the input so that we can get a maximum of 11 volts or something maximum and uh, here i am controlling the output current as you can see the multimeter is set at 200 milliampere volt and uh, here the output current is adjusting below as very high precision up to 10 milliamperes and uh, below you can see the output current can be very very low this is very perfect for testing any kind of LED or uh, very low power components now here the output current is limited to 10.8 milliamperes and uh, I am going to test this LED as the output voltage is almost uh, 10 point something volts but the current limit is set at the 10 milliamperes at the output now 
uh, here you can see the this is the dual LED which is uh, red and green in this single LED but the red LED becomes damaged as the current is quite high for this but the green LED is working very perfect as the current demand for the green LED is a bit high as compared to the red LED as you can see the voltage is 10.8 volts but the current is limited to 10 milliampere now you can see when I current the LED directly with the output volt so the LED just glow fine as the current is limited to very low fixed threshold so that according to the load the voltage drops the required voltage level for the load now after this here the 1 watt power LED this is also a 3 volt LED but the current is limited so I have increased some threshold that's why the LED is growing now we can use this buck converter for charging any kind of lithium batteries with her different voltage levels but in this case I am testing the 4.2 volts that's the charging voltage for the 3.7 volt lithium battery and uh, the voltage is set at 4.2 volts but the output current is uh, you can see it's uh, 180 milliampere but for the testing of my very small lithium battery I am setting the output current at just 150 milliampere so this is the 300 milliampere lithium battery and uh, you can see the current is taking at uh, 120 milliampere for charging in this case now for the current controlling feature um, below the threshold limit so as you can see I have set the output current at just uh, 70 milliampere for this small battery as you can see the charging current for this battery is currently the 60 milliampere which is the very safe for charging in just uh, this kind of uh, very small batteries now you can see we, uh, I can uh, increase the output current so the voltage level is increasing bit high in the multimeter you can see so this is the two days beauty of this upgrading the LM352596 buck converter so this circuit works very well in my case and uh, if you have any doubt regarding this buck converter upgrade so you can ask your comment in the comment section and all the files and details are given in the description so thanks for watching and uh, please subscribe to my channel and also share with your friends so thank you and goodbye